travel the world together and let's enjoy tourism as well. I'm the Kumba guy. Let's go. Last year in January, um, for those who haven't seen my video, you shall find it right here. But here we are once again. For those who do not know, Kazungula Bridge. Kazungula is the border post between Zambia on this side and Botswana on this side. And Kazungula Bridge is the new bridge which is being constructed to span, to join Botswana to Zambia. Uh, all along we've been using the pontoon, you've seen the pontoons before, but now the bridge is coming up and um, it's almost ready. <clears throat> it's ready, it's almost ready for commissioning um, and it looks very beautiful. I shall share some photos and you see how lovely it looks now. The last time I was here, it had a lot of green netting, but now that's been cleared off and the place is almost ready. subscribe to the to the channel to the kumba guy it's very simple just go to the subscribe button click on it 
make sure the bell is on for notifications and you'll be receiving notifications whenever I post a new video. funded by those two governments and um, JICA, Japan International Cooperation Cooperative Agency or something like that. Um, <clears throat> so that's what this bridge is all about. Now for those who do not know, again, this point is what we call a quadri point. It's where four countries meet. We've got Namibia on the other side, we've got Botswana here, and we've got Zimbabwe and the rest of this is Zambia. So those four countries meet, actually they meet at a point almost in the middle of the bridge. Uh, and so that's what we have here. But this bridge crosses right on the Botswana section and into Botswana. And now this bridge was commissioned in 2014 uh, by our Vice President, Dr. Guy Scott and his counterpart, from Botswana. Here we have the foundation stone. Laid by His Honor Dr. Guy Scott, Vice President of the Republic of Zambia, and His Honor Dr. Ponatsheho H.K. Kedikilwe, Vice President of the Republic of Botswana, 12 September 2014. Now, they commissioned it and construction began. It's been about six years now. This is 2020 and it's almost ready for, um, uh, it's almost complete and ready for commissioning and handing over. So this is Kazungula Bridge. It's 923 meters across, 923, the bridge section. And then you've got the off-ramp and the on-ramp. Now this whole project was divided into three packages. Um, the first package was the bridge itself. The second package was the border facilities on the Zambia side and the other, pass, uh, the other border facilities on the Botswana side. This is going to be a one-stop border post, which means you will only need to, be, to do your immigration on one side, whether it's on this side or on this side. For those who've been to Chirundu border, you know how it works. You cross the bridge, and you do your immigration in one, um, in one place. Under the one-stop border post concept, there will be no need to stop twice, as it is happening at the moment. Freight and also passengers, they will only stop on the facility that is on the exit country. So all the people coming from Zambia shall come straight through the bridge, cross the bridge, and go and do the immigration from there, the Zambia exit and the Botswana entry. All those coming from Botswana will cross the bridge, go and do the immigration from there, the Botswana exit and the Zambia entry. So it's going to be one-stop border post. And the purpose of this bridge is to facilitate trade and communication to increase the speed by which trucks are cleared, by which people move, um, and to improve communication, cooperation, and industry within the region. At the moment, as you can see, we've got the pontoon. That accounts for about four to seven days here. Mm -hmm. But with this, the intention is this, that um, we will reduce that time to about two hours. Okay. And two days if things are completely, maybe papers are not in place. Mm -hmm. This is part of the North-South Corridor, all the way from Congo, uh, through Botswana, down to South Africa. A lot of trucks and vehicles use this route for 
exporting copper and uh, bringing in goods and things from that side. Export-dependent economies need connectivity to markets, particularly landlocked countries such as Zambia and Botswana. To integrate their economies, they're financing the construction of the Kazungula Bridge. Just up river from Victoria Falls, it spans the Zambezi River where four countries, Zambia, Botswana, Namibia and Zimbabwe, all come together. The bridge is part of the North-South Transport Corridor, a vital trade route that spreads from the Democratic Republic of Congo to the port of Durban in South Africa. This network links eight economies that contribute nearly 40% of Sub-Saharan Africa's GDP to export markets and the world. So, I'm very excited about the bridge. I know so many people are excited about the bridge. It's almost ready. This is October. Uh, I assume handover shall be very soon and the opening ceremony shall also be very, very soon. Kazungula Bridge Project Manager Godfrey Songea says the Kazungula Bridge will be commissioned soon. Before the commissioning is done, uh, we are expected to, to have the one-stop border post bilateral agreement uh, being signed. So that is one step that is uh, remaining at the moment, which should be concluded as soon as possible. Uh, I've used this pontoon a lot. I've crossed to Botswana many times. But I'm excited to use the bridge. One thing which is going to be interesting shall be <laughs> walking, for those who will be walking, walking from the beginning of the bridge all the way to the end. Normally you walk up to the pontoon, it crosses you over, and you walk up to the immigration port. But that's going to be interesting. It's a beautiful bridge. Like I said before, this is a cable state bridge. So it's got six columns, six main pillars, uh, which have cable stairs. They support the whole bridge.
hope you like this video hope you've enjoyed this and hope you're planning to use the kizungula route and hope you're excited about this bridge as i am i'm the kumba guy welcome to zambia welcome to kizungula let's go Hello everybody, I'm the Kumba guy and I make travel and tourism videos from around Zambia and around the region. Uh, please be sure to subscribe to this channel for more amazing tourism videos about places around Zambia and trips to and from different towns and cities. Uh, share a nice video, a video you enjoy with somebody who might enjoy it too and uh, leave a comment in any of the videos about something you have learned or enjoyed from any of the videos uh, and this one you've just watched um, hope you like the video hope you like the channel i'm the kumba guy let's go